Hi, so today we're gonna talk about how to overcome stress mentally. The overall definition of stress is the, a state of mental and emotional tension or strain from an adverse or difficult circumstance. And that's difficult, that's, that's different for everyone, okay? So God told me, Raven, what stresses you out the most is that you forget your identity. You forget that I am the God you serve. So you're prone to go back to your old ways before me and handling problems all by yourself, making sure that you're on the throne of your heart, playing God, coming up with all your resources, what you can obtain, how the situation can work out for your benefit without any conflict or even any kind of discomfort. But it's not always the best for you. And because you can't see the end from the beginning, it can stress you out. So here's three tips that God gave me. One, remember your identity. Remember that you have a God who you're supposed to have faith in, you know? I needed to learn that his word is something that I'm supposed to expect to do what it says it's gonna do and depend upon it to do what it says it's gonna do. He'll never leave me nor forsake me. I'm the apple of his eye. He'll guide me with his eye. If I ask for wisdom, he'll give it to me liberally, as well as ask anything in my name and I'll do to the glory of God. That's deep, you know? Second thing, submit to change. You're gonna have to realize that I have to be in control of that and you will work with me on that. You will work by talking to me, let's reason together, let's plead together. Like, come, come talk to me. And then lay your case and then trust me in what I'll do. You have to submit that the timing may not be what you want, you know, the answer may not be what you want. Um, and even though you may not hear me, you will trust that I'm working. You will submit to not feeling irresponsible because that's the biggest thing. Sometimes like, why am I not going to do, I should talk to the pastor right now. And I should, you know, try to go get another whatever. God's like, come to me first and then let me educate you through the word of God, through you hearing thoughts from me, whatever it may be, might even come through poetry and then go act. And the third one, actually taking time to sit back and meditate on his words so you can get clear about who he is and how he works. And then at the same time, taking the time to game plan, you know, plan it out, work it out, look at your life, organize it and move forward. But really the core key thing is stop trying to do it on your own. You have someone on your side. You have someone who has your back. You have someone who's having your heartbeat and you're breathing because there's someone who was there before you taking care of everything before you even knew there was a problem. He said, I answer prayers before you ask. That's one of the things that has helped me overcome stress. This is Raven for Regaining Eden with Raven. Regaining Eden, one decision at a time.